Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to cheese the Cyclops in Dragon's Dogma 2. So these are pretty easy to take care of if you know the right strategy. The thing that we want to do is attack this from range, so we're trying to aggro it and pull it over here. Now there's a pretty unique mechanic when they're near bridges, unfortunately one of my pawns ended up falling to their death there. But when they come towards it, they'll stumble and fall over the bridge here. Now what you can do is you can use them as a bridge, but unfortunately janky controls leads to that happening. But what we want to do is attack it as much as we can while it's laying here. Sometimes you can get the kill pretty quickly, but the trick that we're going to be using is trying to dangle it around the water here and it'll take itself out. Now with the Sorcerer Spell, the Ice there, you can hit it with some major damage and knock it down. But what we want to do is we're going to try and run it around in this area towards the water. Using the bow, you can shoot headshots off, which will give it extra damage. But the trick here is to try and lure it over this way. Now what we're going to do is try to get it into position so that it will fall into the water. As that will be an instant elimination for it and we get all the associated experience for that. Be mindful you can't connect, collect the loot from it. But this is going to be a great way to get experience early on. So the trick that we're going to do is we're just going to continue to blast away at it here. And now it's right in position by the water. This is exactly where we want it to be. And we're just going to continue to hammer away at it. Get some headshots if you can because this will stagger and make it step backwards. And then as you can see here he keeps falling backwards and then down into the water. So it's a really easy way to take out the Cyclops and Dragon's Dogma 2. I hope you found this video useful and if you did please hit the subscribe button below. And thank you so much for watching.